How many people are there? It's a bird and park run. Um, done this about three times now. It's a straight out and back course. Lovely little trail. Just along, got paths all the way out along the front. Turn around, come back, and we finish. Just in there. So, yeah, got a PB last time. Sub 20. I don't know if I'm gonna get that today, but we'll give it a go. So, Burnham and Highbridge Park Run is held at the Apex Leisure and Wildlife Park. There were a few strange animals on the route, but it is set in a lovely park. Anyway, with over 14,000 sort of PBs at Burnham Park Run in 350 events, it looks like a pretty quick course. So, uh, let's see what we can do. Notice a brightly coloured man warming up in funky attire. As people were turning up I thought I'd better go and warm up. Warm up done. Uh, looks like quite a nice day. The sun's just starting to come out and I forgot my bloody glasses. Oh well, let's see what we can do. New runners were given a warm welcome and introduced to the course and to park run in general. Now, nearly 300 people made their way to the race briefing. Hi everyone, welcome to Burnham and Highbridge uh, park run. Woo! Have a lovely day for it. Um, there's no wind today, it is a little bit warm, um, but hopefully there'll be some uh, nice fast times today. So. Uh, Welcome to our visitors, we've got visitors from all over today. Uh, I could read it all out, but there's quite a few W's. Windsor, Warwick, Walsall and Western. Um, Stockport and North Yorkshire, so welcome to them. And we have... Uh... Then after a countdown, we were off. With quite a narrow starting position, it's quite important to get towards the front if you're looking for a quick time. After making it out of the starting bend, we meandered around the pond and towards the park. Thank you, Marshall. Entering the park area, we were met by a surprise dog walker. As we approached another amazing marshal, it was a sharp right and towards the estuary. Gravel road for a bit, but look at that view. I believe I was saying I was on for a PB at this stage, but the microphone didn't pick it up. Ran past the guy, what looked like he was selling cockles, but I had no time for that. Some random cheers from the boats. Then towards the long drag towards the turnaround point. Then first place whizzed by, obviously too focused to say hi. But he smashed the race in 16.30, a blistering pace.
approaching the turnaround point, the marshal was too busy talking to some dog owners. But again, no time for chit chat. Onwards to the finish. First Lady went whizzing by and completed an amazing time of 22.03. Then the plethora of people romping past. Then at the turn off point, another dog, again no time for dogs, needed a focus on the race. Cheers. Thank you. Come on. I'd finished. Another PB. Barcode scanned. Hold on, mate. Hold on. All right, guys. Hold on. As I went to support fellow park runners, I reflected on another amazing event. Well organised, well marshalled, well supported and well encouraged. Hold on. Come on, all the way. Yeah, it's quite a few. Hold on, Good job. Hold on. Trying to get out of the wind, you can hear me. Bit of a park run done. Another successful run, sub 20. Again though, very well organised. Uh, amazing start bit with the uh, tannoy and explaining everything. And apparently somebody had a 45th uh, park run, but I think they got confused with 45th birthday today. But uh, no, I was uh, buzzing with that. They're still coming in now. Still coming in, so I don't know how many people there are. I'll find out when I get the official results. So I'm going to head home now and have a protein shake and get ready for one fine night. Let's go.